YouTubers, Tess Jess, one here. Um, Going to do a video on a figure I've not long received, and uh, I like it. I like the look of it. Uh, it's not everyone's cup of tea. It is a German officer from World War Two. His name is Hermann Hermann Goring. He's a three R figure or DID figure. Uh, he comes with a couple of sets of suits and some uh, little extras like a sword and a like a whipping stick type thing. I'm not too sure what it's called. And uh, the box is pretty cool. Shows him dressed in both sets of clothes. I mean, I'm not going to glorify the figure he, the, the person, but uh, he was a uh, involved in some nasty shit in World War Two. But uh, that's him there. A bit of a speech for these all the other officers, I suppose. Yeah. So anyway. Besides that, there is a uh, a second box, an additional box that I bought, and uh, it's uh, basically a decoration set, which comes with an extra head there, a glorified chain necklace, some, a cigar box. The cigar box has got his name on there, so I'm not too sure why, but anyway, maybe he's getting his own brand made for him, I don't know. A uh, pipe, a metal pipe, um, a fancy uh, dagger, and that's all metal, the whole lot. And the chain is metal as well, and the pipe is metal. Yeah, so it's all, all these three things are metal, and you get this cool fur jacket. So that's called the Herman Goring decoration set. Now all up, I paid a hundred. That was sixty dollars posted. This one here, 104. I think you can get it cheaper if you, if you looked around a bit. 104. So, I'm not sure what the postage would have been for this, because it was all included, it was free post. But I'd say probably 50 bucks, roughly, maybe less, 40 bucks. So, 144 dollars all up. I got, I got all that stuff. Cheap. I mean, not everyone's gonna go out and buy it, and I can understand why. Um, he's not a very popular third person, especially in the, in uh, as far as the U.S. and the, especially Britain, Great Britain or England or Germany, is a uh, concern. That he's, he's not a thing that they collect, and I can understand. So, without talking too much, I'm just going to, I'll put all the. The additional set and the, the the figure with all his just his normal fig, uh, stuff, his clothing, uh, combine them so it's all in one piece. I'm going to dress him up in two different outfits, I think. Yeah, two different outfits uh, with all these accessories. Okay, so check it out and tell me what you think. If you want to give me a thumbs down, give me a thumbs down, I don't care. <laughs> Uh, right yeah, let's do it. This is his standard uniform. I've got him dressed in his cape this time. Now the only thing that's uh, extra with this would be the dagger. Which is pretty cool. Just a really nice nice piece that I'm not too sure what this is called but um, that just comes with the uh, the first the original box that's also made out of metal um, plastic I think this is plastic very hard to tell but it's some sort of or nylon painted nylon it might be nylon but all the badges 
a metal. And one thing I wasn't very happy about is all these decoration pieces on the collars had fallen off. This one here had dropped off, fallen off. These ones you put on, the pins you put on, and this one along here. Took me ages to get that on. He's got spurs, I'm not too sure why he's got spurs on. I'm not sure if he rode a horse or he's a horse enthusiast. But they're, they're metal as well. So you get quite a bit of metal on him. Little uh, Nazi logo there on the, whatever you call it, on the, on the side of his shoulder there on his cape. This chain is metal, and the, and the stoppers the bit are on the end of metal. The detail on the face is absolutely amazing. Complete detail there. I mean, you couldn't get much better than that. I'll just show you without his hat on. So his hairstyle. It's got that wet sort of look about it. All these officers, all these German officers, all got that, that steel stare, that cold, cold stare about them. There, yeah. he's got a necklace on there, got some sort of neck band. With all these metal. Uh, emblem is on, on there. Cape off. Put his hat back on. Yes, looks quite, quite snazzed up. He's a very glorified leader of some sort. He just, yeah, he had all the gear. Very fat. Very, very fat. But uh, he was a, uh, a, a World War One pilot under the command of the uh, Red Baron. Uh, so he he would have been a fairly good flyer in the, in the first world war. Just went to shit in the second world war. <laughs> There's Mr. Herman Goring with his metal pipe, tobacco pipe, and he's uh, well, I assume he's his these line of cigars that were made for him for some reason. Uh, the cigar box is uh, an extra that comes with the decoration set. The pipe comes with uh, the first, the original box of Herman Goring's. Goring's. Okay, I'll continue undressing him now and put his other outfit on. Okay, guys, this is the uh, second outfit you get with the the original box. It's usually got a couple of badges here, um, but, but they're on the other jacket and I'm not going to take them off, off and on because eventually I'll break the pins and I'm not going to do that. So I just didn't put them on. Here's his, his lovely sword. Also metal, the whole lot's metal. Yep, all metal. Very heavy actually. Get his hands out for it. I'll see if I can get it out. Okay. 
Very nice. I like my swords. I like my, uh just ordered a heap of samurai swords coming over. They cost me, they're metal ones, and they cost me about uh, what, 40 bucks or something for a set, set of six. So, looking forward to getting them. And there's the shoes. I don't really think much of his shoes. I prefer the real laces than the with the plastic molded ones. Might see if I can get some later on. Uh, back at the jacket. Hmm. Okay, I'll just go put the fur coat on now. Okay, guys. Here's his big ass coat. <laughs> Or his big ass body. Yeah. And that huge gold neck or gold chain that he that he wears with this coat. Yeah. Okay, I'm just gonna chuck a this head sculpt on and that'd be it. Okay guys, this is the last of it, this is the second head, it comes with the collector's um, decoration set from 3R, as you can see it is brilliant the way they painted it up. Heaps of detail all the way down to the back of the tonsils <laughs> the hair pretty much the same as the other head sculpt that wet look veins and everything So there you have it guys. Hammond Goring. German officer, World War II. That's it. Hope you enjoyed my video. Catch ya.